Howdy, hey, hey, Spaceman Josh here, and welcome back to Rimworld, where right we left off. Let's continue onward, and let's we get one more recruit, and let's also look at the uh, the group that's traveling along, because we're almost there. We got less than a day until we reach the landed ship. I want to be so upset if they like, get there, and it's like, where's the rest of your group? You need everyone here to leave, because then that would be severely upsetting. At that point, I'd just call it a win. Get some more of this stuff down. Uh, animal disease. Got the plague. From plague. Or plague. Does this say plague? Or does this say plaque, like teeth? I think this is plague. Make sure that they get proper treatment and get as much rest as possible. Boom, up one. You've got the plague. How do you have the plague? An eclipse. In the middle of the day. It's not what I need. Is your resistance down to zero now? Yeah, recruit. And a solar flare. Lovely. <laughs> so what you're telling me is that there is an eclipse and a solar flare at exactly the same time. I mean, I guess that's okay, because we're not... Because then we don't use any of the power, but we're still using the power. See, now the solar flare is done. It's like... The solar flare turned off most of the electronics, so a lot of our electronics aren't being used. So the eclipse isn't taking away from our battery life. But now it is still. And we got our new recruit. Yay! God, are you wearing a giant sweater? It looks like the sweater's way too big on you. Actually, where are you at? You're over here. Uh, Bio, what are you good at? You are good at intellectual, social, medical, artistic. Actually, is really the best one. And really, you're interested in working with animals. Okay, so you will be one of our main research people as well as uh, one of our main art people. You're decent at doctoring, so we'll be one of the secondary doctors. Uh, same with sort of the warden stuff. Handling, you have a passion for it, and you're pretty good at it, so we'll have you meet, be one of the main handlers. We'll have you be the secondary handler, because Harriet's still better than you. And then we'll also have you uh, do some, uh, do a little bit of practice on cleaning, but we don't need that because we also have the robot. So let's also bring this Harriet down to it, too. Uh, hunting will also... Uh, let's let's leave hunting down to a three, and we need you to get get you a melee weapon if we want. Or sorry, uh, we're gonna have to use one of the poor guns. Equip the poor machine pistol because of life. Yep, and there goes that. Oh, it only used one of them. How helpful. Or not use two of them. My bad. So we're kind of out of power. And we only have one on the circuit board left. But we got six people now. That's fun. Are you there yet? Point two days. They are so close yet so, so far. But we also have all this chem fuel over the place. War revenge. Okay. Come on, just continue killing it. How close to death? Okay, it's it's very far from death. Um, run. Just run. Yeah, okay. Um, you got the rifle. Come on. I need your help. You can do it. Come on. And you need rescuing. Of course you do. Yep. Okay. Where's the warg at? Oh, the warg's over there. It's going after someone else. But the power's out. Oh, okay. We're gonna rescue the warg. 
You're not gonna rescue here yet. Why'd you have kibble on you? Um, Harriet's dead. Oh, well then. That sucks. I'm generating a map for a new encounter. The ship has been found! You've reached the coronage sent by Sharon Wilson and discovered a, a hidden starship. The ship's reactor is still in deep hibernation mode, so it can't fly yet. You can start it up by interacting with the computer core. Charlotte Winstone warns you that the startup process will take about 15 days and the energy signature will be detectable from a long distance away. This sort of energy signature indicates interstellar flight capability and will attract gains of desperate raiders and swarms of deadly mechanoids. You will be assaulted with an intensity you've never seen. Make sure your defenses are prepared first. Okay. So let's uh, jump to the location and start and get started. Oh, okay, that's big. Hi. Where are you all at? You are all right there. So what you're saying... So you need a meal source. So prepare me raw food. So what you're saying is we need to build a base here now. <laughs> interesting, interesting. Orders. Let's cut the... Chop the wood. Everyone's got a lot of stuff that they can do, so. And get this wood chopped. The eclipse is ending. Okay. So let's see. Cut plants. Actually, let's do more chopping of the wood. Let's get a lot of these. We need a lot of wood. We are going to build the ultimate death trap. Mine. I need those components. I need this steel. Let's get this stuff. Let's get the show on the road. I need my steel. Is there any more components around? I need these components. You need as many components as you can get me. Do we already chop down all of those trees? That's scary. How much wood do we have right now? A lot. Equip wood. What? Okay, and how much is it going to take to get a electric, oh, so to get, let's see, do we have any way of getting power? Let's look at work, cycle, we need one person to heavily work on, work on cycling. Robot earn three, you will be our cycler. You need that. See, so we need that. We can probably also, oh, we can't build that yet, though. That's going to take us back three components. We'll be able to do it. Production. Let's get a electric stove. How much is the electric stove going to take us back? We also need, yeah, two more components after that. It's more components there. We need these components. Also, let's get some beds in here now, too. So let's see. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. 
Okay, let's let's also hit a zone. Let's do a stockpile zone. Let's build a stockpile right here. I'm gonna even try working with these people next. They can take care of themselves. We're getting some steel underway, which is good. We're using the wood that's available to us to build our beds. Okay, that's good. We're making some progress. Floors, I need a wooden floor. It doesn't need to be big, it doesn't need to be grand, but I need it. And I need it yesterday. Structure, I need walls. And then I need me to get need to get me a door. Bills. Okay, I need simple meals. I don't need lavishing ones. I just need simple meals. Do until you have 20 of them. Actually, let's go 25. Let's do 25 and start again when you have 10. Pause and satisfied when you, when you need to make another 10. Or actually, let's do just do 50 until so when you're in a half, you can make more. Okay, how many components we got in the mix so far? We got any components mined yet? We need to get this hauling done. Okay, we need to have another thing for the power. Let's get a solar panel out here. That'll help. I think we have enough components just in the world to be able to take care of that. Day is Udo. Okay. Are you seriously beating up the rocket ship that's taking you home? Seriously? You just destroyed the ship engine. What is with you people? Like, what the actual hell? You all need recreation, don't you? Horseshoe pins. Fine. Horseshoe pins. Mine have started. Okay, fine. There's your recreation. Also, here's a chess table. Let's also build you a table. There's five of you, so I only need a two by two. Actually, I technically only needed a one by two. I can do that right there. And do chair, 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 chair. Floors. Structure. A uh, wooden door. Actually, no, don't do the wooden door there. Do the wooden door right there. Low food. I'm aware. Let's 
see. Let's get some harvesting done with some of these berries. Also, kind of wild up we got in the area. Got some mufflos. We're hunting these mufflos for food. Which means we'll need a butcher table. Caravan requests from who? Don't care. Uh, herbal medicine. Yeah, that's a lot. Uh, marine armor. Cool. Starvation from who? You two. You are also still in your days because you decide not to do anything. Also, who has done absolutely no cleaning whatsoever? Who's in charge of cleaning? Robot Earn 3 is, but you also need to cycle. Um, Robot Earn 1, guess what? You've been promoted. Now, let's see. Zone. Home area. Clean this up. Let's allow the movement of plus steel, uranium, and advanced components. Fire! Okay. Did someone put the fire out? It's raining. Seriously? Two? Oh. Okay. It's because it's outside. Yep. Okay. That's going to get fixed real quick. Actually, wait, no. Cancel that. Reinstall it right there. Prioritize that real quick, please. Okay, power. Get some power going on this. Also, let's zone this as home area so it gets repaired. Now the battery's getting stored, which is nice. Uh, electric stove is short sugared in the okay. That needs to get placed somewhere else now, too. Let's place it in here. And then make this indoors as well. Wooden door. And let's put the wooden door right there. Let's also add the chairs to those areas since we know that there are chairs there. It's also a good thing it's spring right now. Otherwise, this would be very much a different because if it was winter, oof. Now that we have some decent stuff going on, let's go into furniture and get some of these wall lights up. Rare thrombos, don't care. Yeah, so we'll want to place walls all around. Also, we should probably have a zone for the dumping stockpile. 
Pirates. Okay, we've hit the 20 minute mark of the video. We are almost there. We are at the landing site and we're getting ready to fight off everything. So, thank you all for watching. If you like to go hit the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, go hit that uh, uh, subscribe button. Uh, if you want, you can also hit the bell, turn on notifications, let you know right when I upload. If you want, there's also on the video a uh, what the YouTube algorithm thinks is the best video of my channel for you to watch. Other than that, thank you for traveling with me today. Spaceman Josh, out.